Stable. Stable. Danny Kerr knows the plan. Rassi Use trying it. to put pressure on here, but actually Quinns are getting go forward. It was almost a penalty there. Marcus Smith has it. Little show and then goes on his own. Beautiful for Marcus Smith. Gives it now. And the try is scored. What a try it is as well. And Caden Murley gets in. Welcome back, Marcus Smith, from your injury. This is what he does well. Fakes, accelerates, so he knows he can't get to him. He goes again, gets past the cover. Gallant's got to step forward just in case. And then he bullets the pass out to Murley. There's that acceleration, gets him through the cover. You can't leave the outside channel. Fiku has gone way too early. He's left his inside centre with gasping at her. A different area of the field with a disrupted Wait. defensive line. There's no point playing attacking okay. rugby against a really set defence. You need to change the picture. Oh, Teddy Thomas through suddenly. Oh, what, is it going to be a solo try? The winger skirts around Mike Brown, makes it look so easy. What a threat he is, and within four minutes, Rassing have the first try. Strong first defence there from Quinns. Look at it, looking for the inside ball, and Imoth coming off his wing, and Woki gets him moving again, and now Rassing really can attack this line, and the ball sits up nicely. Opportunity, and try comes for Rassing. The early try will do wonders for them. Motivated or not, they know how to play rugby, and they know how to play rugby wide. Look at the offloads, forwards, backs, Little bit of a look on the bounce. Get on, literally step. He could have walked over himself. He could have scored, but he pops it up to the skipper, and over he goes. All started from a really nice break from Legarac. Little show and go. Ball back on the inside. And it's just such nice play. It's a willingness to keep the ball alive, even if it goes on the ground. Care to the shorter side. Oh, space here for Head. Lovely burst from that. He's gone beyond Russell. He's gone all the way and it will slide home for a tremendous score on his Heineken Champions Cup debut. George Head in the third minute of the game. I think it was uh, the number eight who just got himself on the wrong side and allowed George Head on the outside. Oh, and Jamie, be. defensively, it's a big error from Racing. In this. Winter's afternoon, Zebo now has options outside in Tampa Fanu, and away he goes, the young winger, sparkling feet, and there's Zebo, and Zebo will make it surely to the corner, and they've started the second half as they did the first, even more quick. Keeps the ball alive to Murley. And they play quickly, Quinns. And the ball is there for them. What an effort this is by the 14 men. Can't Short. quite get it there. Kerr spins it out, marches, and flings it wide. Real chance now, Murley for the try. <laughs> Well, what an effort this is by Harlequins, by the 14 men, conversion to come to draw level. Look at this, over his head, Dink takes it out of the sky, brilliant from the hooker. They recycle, Esther Hayes and goes for the line, doesn't quite make it. Marchin throws the long pass, he's a walk-in, isn't he, this scenario? The Garak, who's been absolutely everywhere defensively. And you just see their spring doesn't quite get there, does he? No. Murley can finish. Get back nicely, Machino. Wenceslas Lorry trips over his own man, but still gets that ball away. Russell, out wide it goes. Gathered by Talpa Fanu, and gets it down. <laughs> and it's Donka Ryan who's on for Dominic Bird, so a little bit of experience and Chisholm. We talked about his energy since coming on, and there is Steele now. Support out wide, but he won't need it. Steele to the corner. Does he get it down? He does. Try. Sharks. Ooh, and uh, Joe Marler. Crowd didn't like it, but it was just a good hefty hit. Uh, Rassing with a chance here. Boudon, here he goes, the back rower. He can fly, he has support, and what a start to the second half. Rassing score. Saili goes over. Well, they go through the phase really well. Lovely pass again out wide. Look at the acceleration from him. He runs away from the cover, puts the ball right out in front of Saili. Just got to dot it down. Against his former side. Francis Saili, three seasons at Quinn's, third try now for Rassik. Height from the back row. And there is Boudon as the link for Camille Shan. On it goes. Advantage as well to Rassing as Saili carried it on. Oh, and a try for Rassing. And it goes to Kationi Kamikamika. But then it's just the ability to carry through here. You watch Will Evans, he blitzes out the line, takes, reads the wrong defender, thinks it's going to the out, wrong attacker, sorry, thinks it's going to the outside.
Quinns need to make this pay. They've had all this pressure up the other end. Here's Esther Hazen darting back against the grain and crashing over. Has he grounded it? A lovely little line to step back on the inside. That's asking an awful lot of the inside defence to stop someone that size. Emery's yeah, got no chance there. I think it's a 90 defending first off scrum. You have to mark at that. There's a carry by Cullingar. Good. Leganek gives it wide. Must be there now, and it is. Well, it was only a stay of execution. The try comes for Racing. Ten minutes to go, and now they get to 40 points. Just a little bit too slow, and left they go. And there's Francois Tranduk again. He's over, and it looks so easy from Tranduk.